Andrew Grosvenor. I'm an associate professor in the Department of Chemistry at the University of Saskatchewan. I had a great high school chemistry teacher and he really got me interested in how atoms interact with each other, how they bond, how different molecules and different compounds form and I really found that fascinating. Uh, so right after high school going into my undergraduate I knew I wanted to be a chemist. The interest of my research group in the Department of Chemistry uh, is solid state materials. In particular, we study metal oxides, uh, but the focus is on nuclear materials. We work with Arriva Resources Canada in Saskatchewan to help them understand the solid waste tailings in their McLean Lake facility. We also work with Canadian nuclear labs to develop new nuclear fuels, and we're also working on developing materials for the sequestration of nuclear waste. And these are very complicated materials, they have a complicated chemistry and the, and the more information that companies like Arriva Resources has on the composition of the tailings, the better they can predict how those materials will change over time and potentially uh, interact with the environment. So it's really all about environmental stewardship. The techniques that we have available to us at the Canadian Light Source really allow us to understand how atoms bond, what happens to a material when it changes composition, change its structure. Having a synchrotron in Saskatchewan really opens up a, a broad wealth of techniques that can then be used to solve Saskatchewan problems.